Hey guys, so in this tutorial I'm going to teach you guys how to make a level and XP system. Let's get started. These are all the chips you need. I'll put them on screen right now. You need a button, an event receiver set to room loaded, a greater than or equal to chip, a random int chip, an if chip, six variable integer chips, two add chips, a multiply and a divide chip, three two string chips, two string format chips, and two text. To start, we gotta configure these chips like so. The random integer chip needs to be configured like this. It can also be customized to your liking, but this is the setting I like to use. The minimum amount of XP you can get per kill is five. The maximum number of XP you can get per kill is 10. You can configure these to your liking. Make sure the minimum is less than the maximum. Next, we have the string format. The format needs to be set like so. XP, make sure they're both capital, colon, space, open bracket, zero, close bracket, slash, open bracket, one, close bracket, make sure you have two extra values. The second string format needs to be set like so. It only needs one value. The first text you need is this. Make sure you configure it and type in the exact text I have here. The second text needs to be configured like so. Make sure you configure it and type exactly what I have here. You also need this variable to be configured and named exactly how I have. Make sure you set it the input integer to 20. Next we have the level. Make sure you set the name of this variable chip to exactly how I have it here and the input needs to be set to 1. Make sure your variables are named exactly how mine are. Finally, make sure your variable chips are all synced. Next, I'm gonna set up the chips. You can follow along. I'm gonna take the button, place it over here. First thing that needs to be wired into the button is the randomizer chip. The next chip you need is the if chip. The next chip you need is the greater than or equal to chip. You then need to wire the input of the if chip into the output of the randomizer chip. Next, you need the level. And the XP. You then need both the ads. Place the first ad under the XP. Then place the second ad above the level. Make sure you wire them like so. You'll then need to wire the A of greater than or equal to the sum of the ad chip on the bottom of XP. Then you need to wire the bottom value of the ad chip for the XP into the output of the integer side, like so. Then I'm gonna take both the text. I'm gonna place the XP right above the button. Move the control panel over here. I'm also gonna take the level. Put that above the XP. Put the control panel over here. Then I'm gonna take the string format for the level place that next to the level control panel. I'm then gonna take the string format for the XP and place that next to the XP control panel. I am then gonna wire like so. Then I'm gonna take the two strings, put two next to the XP string format, like so. And 
And then I'm gonna take the last string format and place it right here. I'm then gonna take the multiply and divide chip, place them over here. Next, I need the TXP variable chip and place that right here. I am then gonna wire the output of the TXP into the input of the greater than or equal. Make sure it's on the bottom, B. I am then gonna wire the output of the TXP into the top value of the multiply chip, the product into the top value of the divide chip. Make sure you wire the quotient into the input of the TXP. I'm then gonna configure the divide chip to seven and the variable, the multiply chip to 10. This just makes it so it slowly adds up every single level of the total XP you need to get in order to level up. Then I'm gonna take the XP, and put that right here. I'm gonna take the level, put that right here. The total XP, put that right here. And then the event receiver room loaded, put that right here. And then a wire like so. I'm also gonna wire the two strings like this. I'm then going to wire the if chip like so. I'm also going to wire the add chip like so. This should be your final product. It should be wired like so. If you would like to gain the XP and level a different way other than a button, all you need to do is wire the execute right, right here instead of the button. I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. If you guys have any issues, make sure you leave a comment down below. I'll respond to everyone that needs an issue. You can also message me on the Rec Room Discord. My, my Discord is Jerry B. It's also in the description below. You can add me if you want. Thank you for watching. Bye.